what is this shadow of the bloody colossus hello you sexy biscuits and welcome back into elden ring i'm gonna say right now i bloody love this game i'll be honest i could never get in to the dark souls games but that's okay because this in theory isn't dark souls but there's one enemy who has been making my life hell and today i want to get my revenge yeah i'm looking at you oh i think you're me um uh, i wasn't ready oh god <laughs> Uh, hang on, hang on, I need to recoup, hang on. Okay, it's gonna be like this, is it? Let's go. So, I've got a cool weapon that I will use after I get flattened. That was supposed to happen. Oh, great and holy God, Ross, why am I the worst at Elden Ring? It's okay, though, because I have a plan. I am currently holding Bloodhound's Fang. Now, this you get from a very early boss. If you want this for yourself, it, it, he's right there. You just go and fight him. He's really bloody difficult. It's all right, though. Just do guard counters, like, all the time. This weapon has blood loss buildup. So every time I hit an enemy, it builds up. And when the fifth or sixth strike happens, they lose a ton of health. And I'm going to use this weapon today to beat the Tree Sentinel. Now, currently, I am level 30. I've put a lot of time into this game. Uh, too much, to be honest. Um, <laughs> but I'm hoping this works. Right, I've called in how. Let's go. What I'm going to try and do here is just circle the Tree Sentinel as much as I can and get in some... It's fine. That always happens. Ah, my god. Run away! It's fine. I'm safe in here. Whoa! <laughs> I'm not safe. I lied. Oh my god. That cooey. I'm back, you smelly armpit. Okay, good hit there. I'm going to try and get as close as I can. Keep hitting right into him. The faster you go, the less he knows what to do. Dodge. Nice. Okay, come back round. I'm going to keep building up this blood loss. And let's hope this works. Okay, go back round. He's going to follow me round. I need to recoup my stamina. Woohoo! <laughs> okay, keep hitting. Because every time I don't hit him, his blood loss goes back down. So I need to keep on top of him here. Oh, God. Ah! Okay, I got slightly stuck in the tree. <laughs> oh, my kidneys. But as you can see, my strategy is sound. As long as you keep moving around the tree sentinel, he doesn't know what to bloody do. So we're going to try that again. This time, dodge every attack he tries throwing at me. And we're going to keep hitting him as hard as we can and as quickly as we can and not be afraid to move out the way of him before he can get a strike in. Okay, it's all about building up. All we need to do is keep riding around him as quickly as possible so he can't get any hits in. So I'm just going to keep battering him, but also remembering to stay out of his way. Now, what I will say, it's generally easier not to target him when on horseback. And it basically means that you aren't stuck to having the camera constantly swinging around to look at him, which can throw you off. So I'm going to keep going around. We're going to keep hitting. Nice. Okay, that is a good hit. Good hit. God, I'm just waiting for that blood build-up to happen. We're almost there. Okay, he went for an attack. Let's keep going around. Now, one thing about the Tree Sentinel is he is very good against magic. So if you're trying to use magic against this guy, he has a shield that he can pull out and defend against that. But obviously, that's something we don't need to worry about right now. But if you are using a magic-based character... Oh, there you go! That right there was the blood loss. Okay, right, I've bloody got him. Now, another strategy we can have here is the fact we can also bring in something to distract him. Let's say the wolves. So I'm going to bring in my wolves here, and we can use those as a distraction as we go in for those fast hits. Okay, good hits. See, as right now, he is definitely trying to attack the wolves and not me. So I'm keeping his attention off me. Oh, 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 nice. Okay, that was a pretty damn good hit. Now, the dogs go down quite quickly, um, but they are honestly one of my favorite summons in the game so far. Nice, that was a good hit there. Okay, I'm just going to keep going around, build back up my stamina. Dodge out the way. Oh, he hit my horse really bad then. 
Oh, it's all right. How sticky in there. Oh, okay. All right. How is not looking good right now. That earthquake attack he does is ridiculous. One more hit and how is down. My wolves are now down, but he is under half health right now. There you are, you bastard. Let's do this. Okay, yeah, he just stood on my face. By the way, my horse is named Hal. Uh, it's not Torrent. Everyone else is just called Torrent. My horse's name is Hal because he looks a bit like a horse and a cow mixed together. Dodge out of the way! Go! Come on! Come on, baby, you got this! Come on! No! <laughs> that was so close! Hi! Okay, right. This is it. The final challenge. Let's go. Good hits going in there. Come on. Come on. Last wolf remaining. He's got to get those blood hits in. Come on. Ah, hold in there, how? Oh my god. Ah, get up. Get up. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need to have a lie down. You cannot believe the amount of trouble that bastard has put me through. <laughs> Screw you in the face, you tree sentinel bastard. The stupid part is you haven't even given me enough runes to bloody level up. 3,200. That's bloody useless. I swear that guy was going to give me a bloody hernia. Right, let's take a look at the weapon we just got our hands on. I'm not able to use it yet because I'm not 30 in strength. But let's take a look and actually see how this thing handles. Are you ready? Right, here it is. Okay, so we've got a stab attack, which is kind of like a ground pound. We've got the swing. Oh, that's so cool. What weapon art does this thing have? Uh, nothing. I I'm guessing I need uh, a <laughs> skill to be able to do that. Ah, yeah, 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 screw you. I am so happy that I took down the Tree Sentinel. Honestly, that feeling you get when you finally take down that bastard who's been making your life literal hell. Uh, it, it's so good. It's so worth it. It's absolutely bloody amazing. I want to thank you for watching this video. I love each and every single one of you. Thank you very much for watching. But until next time, that's me out. Bye, guys. Pico, Pico the penguin. Pico, Pico the penguin. Pico, Pico the penguin. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay.
Thank you.